Before this video started, I wanted to give a shout out to a guy named Bryce Gibson that I met on Omega. He sang excellent. Like when when he was singing, I was like, I was I was like taken back. You're good. Um Bryce underscore Gibson with the I in it got a one in it. Um if that makes sense. He's on my Instagram. Um follow him if you want. Um other person I got a shout out is Project X um VM. He, they in my, um, he's in my feature. Um, check him out, too. He helped me. Um, I talked to him. He's a real cool dude. Um, I'm not going to say his real name. I don't even know if people know his name, but, you know, a like, cool guy. <laughs> um, and also a, a kid named Owen. Um, his channel is Our Nation. Um, I put him in my feature. And check him out. Um, if he put out more videos, hey, subscribe to him. Them out. Um, help out project, subscribe to him too, and what else? Um, so yeah, that's it. Let's get started with this video. Also, Bryce, I also remember the, the friend you was with, she is super cute. I didn't want to say anything to make her feel uncomfortable, so I just wanted to say that to be clear. Um, enjoy the video, let's get it. <laughs> um, today's video is going to be about um. The players that I trust in BB19, Big Brother 19. Um, so, it's only six of them that I trust. Number one, it is not in, in in particular orders. I'm just going by what I wrote down. And I had some, I had one on the list at first, but then some people lost my trust. Um, wait, are oh, they trust has lost me? I don't know. You know what I mean. Um, <laughs> so, number one, Josh. Um, Josh showed me that even, like, we all know he kind of like a hothead, but, you know, he know when to calm down. Like, he, in his interviews, he said he needs somebody to calm him down. Some people have help with that, but, you know, he's learning how to, like, you know, chill out. It, but I do gotta say, when, um, I don't know exactly, um, uh, what happened, um, when he and the Jessica was arguing, the funny thing he said was, um, Meatball, what did he say? He say, Laguini and Meatballs. He said, it's your last supper, enjoy it. I was, I, that was pretty funny. Um, Marcus, try not to laugh, that was hilarious. Um, but, yeah. Other than that, I, I think he been, you know, trying to keep it low for as far as he could. Because his person, like he said, his personality is big. And he's trying, at least. He at least trying. Um, so, next with is um, Raven. Raven is the slipping. Raven is this um redhead. Oh, she like I said, man, she is fine. Um, man. Okay, stop. Okay. Um, she's very attractive. Like I said. Um, other than that, she she is like what can I say? I want to say nurturing in a way. I'm not sure, but I mean. Like, you know, she went to Josh when he was crying. To him, oh, you know, you, you know, you could, you could be, what, what did she say exactly? I just know, I just know she was trying to be sweet. Um, I do have to say, like, she, I don't know if she gave tickets, how Matt, Matt gave tickets to, um, Paul about the HOH, but they was looking kind of stupid when Paul was like, you know what? I should throw y'all up on the block as pawns. Like, that's what y'all get. I lost Matt respect when he gave Paul tickets. I was like, no, you do not do this. You try to win things on your own. Even though I know most of them did it, I, I saw it personally on the show, Elena and Matt um, give the tickets. And Christmas, but Christmas, she she have a, um, a excuse because, you know, she got a broken foot. You know, so might as well just give it to Paul for her. But everybody else, I could have won it y'all so. It's like, man, y'all, I don't like that. I, me, if I go in the game, I like to win at all costs. Like, to me, winning equals safety. So I'm trying to win everything. I know it's not that good to try to do that, but just think about it. If you try to win everything, you're not going to win everything. So, with that being said, win as much as you can because you're not going to win them all. So, but, so far, she, personally, she... Haven't really done anything that Raven, I'm talking about Raven, and that haven't done anything that is, you know, like, that I think is, like, bad, 
you know um so yeah i mean her being her i mean hello hello dance in that um in the what is that in the um diary room was a little cocky but hey i mean she was just trying to have fun so i don't blame her but um who else dominique oh did, like some people say she do not get enough camera time um I, I actually like her like for black players ah uh, she is like what can i say um i want to because it's to me if i were to when i go in a game i'm gonna say when because you know what I'm saying. um it's only one black person that i think played a very very excellent oh i ain't gonna say it it ain't just one i'm gonna say since i've been watching since season five for the first four seasons i'm not sure about all that but jamika if y'all know who jamika is she was on dick season she got to final four it's like come on when the last time you saw a black person get to final four let's be for real um but yeah dominique she is very smart she know how to speak well um she know i think she know I, I, I don't see her not going far in this game. Her gameplay is really good right now. She's keeping it low key and being smarter when to say something at the right time. And um, I gotta say the little counter that she had in the um kitchen with Mark about being him be, gaining weight. She was like, oh boy, you need to um you need to lose some of them pounds because you know you a little sticking out in the stomach, boy. Are you pregnant? No, <laughs> but um, so that was that. Speaking of Mark, though, he's the next one that I trust. It's only six of them. He's number four. He's not number four. You know, like I say, anyway, y'all know. Um, it just he's such a good guy, and he what have he done that's really bad in this game? Nothing. He's helping people out. He's not arguing. Like, like I said in the other video, he's a big teddy bear. So, I you know I just like Mark. You know. And would I let him train me? No, because I think he'll like it, he will try to make me pass out. I'm not about to do all that. But we can hang out, you know. So that's that. Um. So next is Jason. Thing about Jason, uh, Jason, he's doing this. He don't know anything about the game. When I say that, I mean he he never really watched the show before. And for him not even watching the show and the things that he's doing now is using his common sense and to play in this game, the things that you're supposed to do, he's doing it. It's like, what can I say? When he was backed up in the corner by Cody about voting a certain way, he I think he kept his word. Yeah, yeah, he kept his word. And, you know, he was like, you got me backed up in the corner. But at that point, I was like, what else could he do? You know, me. I mean, personally, he could have, you know, like, lie but you know he didn't so yeah he's entertaining in some ways i gotta say when they i don't know if anybody ever saw like um videos of them popping up and scaring people i think he got scared he was scaring people and stuff like that it was a fun time um uh, next is ramses um at, like i said at first i wasn't feeling them but i do like them now I think everybody is like, I don't know, Paul was telling Kevin, it, by the way, this whole video was spoilers, if you didn't know, I'm gonna try to have it in the title, um, but Paul tried to tell, well, he didn't try, he told Kevin to vote out Ramses, and Kevin already, I think Kevin was already gonna do that in the first place, because him and Ramses, it's something going on where it's like, you know, a little smart undergrowth talk, so, you know, then Kevin said that Ramses didn't have no testicles, I'm like, well, and I don't think, you know, hey, y'all don't want in the house, y'all know. But, um, so that's that. Now, I, and another thing um, about the punishment that Rams has got, it, I heard um, that he was going to get another punishment, that Christmas tried to put the voodoo thing on him, um, but the show wouldn't let him get two in a row, which I got to say, at least good looking out, CBS. Um, well, I should say Big Brother Production. Cause that that would be super unfair if like everybody keep picking the same person for punishment. I'm like, you know, I gotta give y'all thumbs up on that. Gotta give you props. 
one thing I was gonna say, I don't know who's going on the block, but I hope, I just hope Cody's gone. Um, if not Cody, I prefer, you know what, to be honest, I wouldn't mind if Jessica go before Cody, because she is an annoying, she is like a little bug. It's like, girl, hush up and keep quiet, please. I like, you're, you're annoying. You're not too annoying, but you're somewhat of annoying. It's like, since you, you know you're not gonna have Cody, you're, you might, I don't, she says she's not kissing butt, but is that going to be the case? But they said like, hey, they just, people trying to be cordial in that house, and, you know, that's that. And, like, another thing, it, people getting pissed off at Ramses for trying to win the veto. It's like, if you was in the same position, you would try to win. You can't get mad at him for that. He is, just, he is getting such a raw deal that it is ridiculous. But so far, I'm enjoying the season, and yeah, that's it. Um, I'm, I got a fresh cut. If you didn't know, hey, check it out. It's cool. Um, yo, with these glasses, somebody said I look like a doctor. I'm like, do I really look like a doctor? Hi. Um, here's your test results. <laughs> but, um, share, like, comment, and subscribe. You don't have to. It'd be, it'd be a big help if you did. Um, so, yeah. Anything, any questions you want to ask me, leave it in the comments below. And peace.